of uh, uh -huh. Richmond, Virginia here and a native of well a refugee in Beach, Boston, <laughs> Texas. Gentlemen, I had quite a weekend. Talk to him about that. It's not over yet. <laughs> Tell me, uh, 1.30? When did that become a possibility? When did you think the that was The last possible? five yards. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't a thought before yeah. then. I agree. The <laughs> only thing that we know is whatever Townley goes on an 800 free relay, the next day he goes the same day. <laughs> he does. Well, two days later in our conference he did. Split 133 low, he went 133 low, flat start. So I told the guys that, so they think I'm a genius, but I told them about 10 other things too. <laughs> so you think you should just do a flat start on relays from now on? <laughs> I don't He's know, it's, not, it's not that good, so. What does that say about his 500 potential? It means his 500 wasn't very good. <laughs> oh. Thank you. <laughs> You're 130, don't you go out 134? Well, I wasn't 130 at the time. <laughs> That's true. Just a math <laughs> so let's let's rewind to Wednesday. When you went, when you split 130 and you saw your split, did, did it feel like you were going that fast? And when you saw it afterwards, did you think it was a mistake even? Uh, I don't know what it felt like. It just I've never really felt that feeling before. Uh, no, I didn't. I didn't know until I got out of the pool and. Uh, I think one of the guys came up and said, you went 130 point. And I didn't really believe him at first. And then like three other people told me, and I guess that's when it hit me. And I was just, whoa. <laughs> was tonight's 20, 90 going out in the first 50, was it as relaxed as it seemed to look to those of us in the stand? Um, Tell him the truth. <laughs> no. <laughs> at, I mean, at, his, at his heart, he's in the mile tomorrow. But his heart is in the hundred free. <laughs> <laughs> well, what are the prospects now? Would you have expectations, either of you, for uh, for the mile tomorrow? Well, he and Clark like to go out ahead of everybody, so it's going to be interesting. Are they next to each other? No, uh, but they can see that so. far. <laughs> They're about three lanes apart. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Eddie, we, we got to ask. Um, what's going on with Clark? You said he, you know, he didn't have a good 500 yesterday, didn't swim at all today. Where's he, he at for, for that mile? <clears throat> Clark worries way more than anybody that can work out like he works out should ever worry. Mm -hmm. And he just he slept about an hour or two the night before the 500. And I just thought it'd be best to take him out of the 200. We've got some good goals in the mile and We'll run with a mile. Yeah. Uh, tell me, so you, you come in, this team already won pretty big last year, and you're the and you're suddenly the best swimmer on this team. How is that? How how is that transition been? What, what does it feel like to be you know in that in that hot seat? Uh, awesome. I mean, uh, you know, I couldn't have done it without the team or the coaches. Uh, Thanks. <laughs> you know, uh, like Eddie said, Clark's probably the best trainer in the country and uh you know i swim either right next to him or right behind him every day so uh <laughs> <laughs> mostly <laughs> behind, mostly behind. More like, yeah. but, uh, uh it's just incredible i mean i couldn't ask for a better better group of guys to do this with in richmond you were a very undemonstrative young man uh i noticed a change in demeanor now talk. that you're in texas i uh, wish it, it may be because of the uh I hate to word, use the word, this guy, I won't say clown, next to you, <laughs> yeah, does he help loosen you up and, and being a part of what's a, a really a, a close team? Careful. Um, has that helped where your, your club team didn't have the kind of camaraderie that, that this Texas team has? Um, yeah, I mean, you know, my club team definitely had camaraderie. I don't want to say anything bad about them. They're all great guys, but uh, I guess... Ed and all the guys kind of helped me open up a little bit. Come uh, out of his shell. Yeah. yeah. How does that 200, American record 200 yard time translate to a 200 meter time? Uh, I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, as far as where, are you a long course swimmer? Are you a short course swimmer? Where oh, did you? you see the turns? <laughs> yes, I did. Uh -huh. Michael McBroom texted me and said, what's he going to do when he learns to turn? He's turning 
a lot better than he has in the past. But that is not one of his strengths. So I would, as good as he is, right this summer long course is going to be better for him. Hey, there are a lot of people around the country that just decided they were going to practice harder tomorrow morning because <laughs> of what he did tonight. And if his turns improve, he's going to go faster in the 200 yard. We'll even throw in two fly kicks off the wall. <laughs> that is funny. <laughs> so what was, what was your expectation going into tonight? Um, what were you thinking about? Um, I try not to think about much, but, uh, you know, I had the relay split in mind, and I guess just be as close to that as possible. Uh, I guess never would have expected to go faster than that. Did you realize, though, that how vaunted this record has been, the U.S. Open record that's been around for, you know, I, I, I think it was Can a you, decade and a day, yeah. plus, you know, as many times as some of your, you know, your Texas predecessors tried, Walters and Ricky, it just no one had gotten it. Does that sort of set in that you just broke a really legendary record? Uh, Almost, not yet. I don't know. It's still, I guess, it's still processing it. Almost. Is that it? It's good for me, but he did get a uh, text from Simon Burnett. You got it. Text I got it. He <laughs> said, uh, "Tell Townley to keep listening to me." <laughs> no, he congratulated Townley on his swim. Yeah. So I immediately got back to him and asked him if he's thinking of a comeback. <laughs> and, he said, and he said, not now. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Appreciate Thanks. it. Thank you.